Oh, hey, glad you could make it. Hey, Winston, come back in, buddy. Let me take your coat for you. Let me just put that right over here. Winston, come on in, buddy. Come on. Okay. Winston's a standard schnauzer, but you probably already knew that. They come from Prussia. Originally, they were used as farm dogs and stuff to uh, kill the rabbits and rodents and small things like that. They would eat the crops. But now uh, he likes chicken these days. Mostly it's just chicken and healthy things like that. Some rice sometimes. This is Charlie. She's originally from Puerto Rico, but now she lives in Massachusetts. And Winston, I already introduced you to. He's in finance. Okay, so you can go ahead. We'll come on upstairs. We'll let you in. Can I get you a mineral water or anything? I always have lots of low sodium mineral water and other healthy snacks laying around. Do you want a mineral water? No? Oh yeah, okay. Alright, we'll go ahead and open that up for you. And uh, here, have a seat here and we'll, uh, we'll hang out. So I got a buddy, his name's Mike, and he started doing these drawing lesson things online. So that's kind of cool. And I said, oh gee whiz, I could do that. That can't be too hard. So this is uh, just my way of getting this started. I'm really glad you could come over. I was afraid you wouldn't be able to make it because this whole global pandemic thing and all. People are really losing their minds, but not me. I mean, at least you and me, we're, we're staying pretty sane, so that's good. Um, anyway, all right, what do you want to, let's, let's start a drawing. What do you want to draw today? Let's go ahead and, well, whatever, we'll just figure it out as we go, right? I mean, like I said, it can't be too hard. All right, let's do it. All right, so I thought today we could do my friend Slimer here, start off my own drawing thing. I'm really glad that it, that guy Mike gave me this idea. This is pretty neat, and it'll give me something to do. I feel like we've all been looking for something to do. So I'm starting with that little shape there. It's kind of like a rainbow, but it's kind of weird. Let me move it there for you. That's a little better. All right, then we're going to go like this and swing down on the side. That's going to be Slimer's cheek. I don't know if he has a cheek or not really because he's a ghost, but it's kind of like a cheek. Then we're going to do some eyeballs. It's going to be a, a circle, oval kind of shape like that. And then he's going to want another eye. Oh, but his nose is going to be in the way of the other eye, so we'll do that first. It's going to be kind of like that. Just a little swoop. Give him a little nose there. Then his other eye is going to be another oval kind of leaning in like that. Just coming in from the side a little bit there. Then he's going to want some pupils in the middle there. Give him a couple of little dots right in the middle of his eyes. I don't think he probably has very good eyesight because he's got such tiny pupils. But I don't know for sure. I never really asked him. And then we're going to give him his other uh, cheek. But first we got to give him some brows like that. And then we'll give him his other eyebrow area like this. Give him a little brow line. Every ghost needs a good brow line. And then we're going to give him his other cheek. It's just going to kind of swoop out like this and then come back down and swing down a little bit like that. Then we'll give him his other cheek. Come over here. Kind of do that underneath his eye. And then his other cheek over here. The bottom part of it. And then we're going to go like that over here too. And then he's going to want to smile connecting that. So we're just going to go like this. It's a really smooshed smile like a weird letter U shape and then I'm gonna come over here and I'm gonna go way down like this and then swing over like that and just come up a little bit not all the way yet because we're gonna have to put in Slimer's tongue his tongue's always hanging out for some reason he's real slobbery and drooly and stuff but that's okay my dog's kind of the same way I know a couple people that are like that too that are always drooling and stuff and spitting when they talk. So there's going to be the start of his tongue. And then we're going to come up like this and back down over here. And then from way over here on the side we're going to come up and then come back down and interrupt that like that. And then next we're just going to go like this down here to make the bottom of his tongue. And now that we have all this then we can finally connect this over here. I first met Slimer way back uh, during all the weird paranormal activity surrounding the terrible Sumerian god of destruction Gozer the Gozerian when, when Gozer came back to New York City. That was a pretty wild time. I was living at 55 Central Park West at the time right down the hall from the beautiful Dana Barrett. She's a classical musician. You might have heard of her. She's a pretty big deal. 
I was lucky enough to be living close by. I was an accountant. She wasn't really very impressed by me, but I was always trying to talk to her whenever I could. And so I just made another U shape there for his lower lip, uh, if you didn't catch that. And then I'm going to come down on the side over here, like that. And another one over on the other side, coming down like this. And then next up, we're going to give him some arms, I think. So we're just going to go like that, give him a tiny little inward bend for his elbow. And then another swoop down for his arm like that. I got to move him again so you can see what I'm doing here. And then on the other side of his arm, we're going to go like this, give a quick little swoop. And then I'm going to give him three fingers, so I'm going to go like this. These are kind of hot dog shapes. I really like the hot dogs in New York. They're pretty good. I don't know. If people say that the secret's in the water. I don't really know. I just know I like to eat them. I wonder what you guys put on your hot dogs. I eat a hot dog pretty much any way it comes. I like it with plain or with ketchup and mustard or just mustard or with relish. Sometimes I eat them with chili, but I don't think that's as healthy for you usually try to stick to healthier foods. I like to drink a lot of mineral water. It's really good for you. All right, then I'm going to give him his other arm over here. But first, I need to start where his belly is going to go, so I'm going to make a little line there. And then here's his forearm. You can't see as much of this arm. You're only seeing about this space. And then I'm going to give him his thumb here, so I'm going to swing down like this and kick it out a little bit. Give him a thumb shape like that. Then we got to do three fingers again. I'm going to draw them this direction this time. So we're coming up. Here are those little hot dogs again. They're all connected like this. And then one more like that. And hopefully it meets right back up with the wrist again. Okay, so we're doing pretty well so far. I hope you're keeping up. Hopefully I'm not going too fast. Now we need to give him his big old Slimer booty, so we're going to swing down here. This is like a big U-shape coming all the way over, like this. And then I'm just going to make this line that I started over here come down like this. And then we're going to give him a little lumpy uh, roll here, and then connect all that. And then we'll give him one more little lump there, and maybe a couple more lines coming out like that. And now he doesn't quite look like Slimer yet because he's still missing his teeth. Slimer's got teeth, so we need to put those in there. I'm gonna give him, we'll just give him four teeth. A couple right up here. He's got kind of big chompers in the front. Like that. And then one more we'll do over here. And then we just need to connect them all across for the gums like that. All right, that's not too bad for my first drawing video that we made Slimer. So that was kind of cool. My friends trapped him one time in a hotel. He was flying around. It was pretty wild. Some people don't believe me that I'm friends with them, but I really am. I'm really good friends with them. They're Dr. Stance and Venkman and Spengler and my friend Winston. I'm good friends with all of them. I really got in good with them when I accidentally became Vince Clortho, the key master of Gozer. But that only lasted for a day, and then I went back to normal again, so that's how I became friends with them. And don't let anybody tell you otherwise, I really am good pals with those guys. They let me ride in their car one time. That's not true, because they made me ride in the ambulance. But I wanted to ride with them, but the police didn't let me, because they didn't know that I really was friends with those guys but it would have been cool uh, someday I want to ride in it it's the, they call it the Ecto-1 it's an old Cadillac it's pretty cool alright there's our, there's our Slimer I hope you were able to follow along I hope you understood everything I said I hope I wasn't talking too fast and you guys were able to keep up alright there he is hey neat thanks for watching this was really fun Okay, so there's the Slimer that we drew. I hope you enjoyed following along. And it's a good thing we didn't even have Gozer interrupting us or anything like that. I know she likes destruction and stuff, but she didn't interrupt us. And we didn't have any visits from the Stay Puft Marshmallow Man or anything. So everything's totally good here. No craziness. Because we're staying home. We're not dealing with all that stuff. 
but uh, and I'm drinking plenty of mineral water, trying to just try to do, do you know, do my usual regimen, trying to stay healthy. Uh, you know, just being smart about things. And don't forget, guys, if you got to go out anywhere, don't forget to wear your protective stuff. There's a lot of crazies out there, and you don't want to have to be dealing with them. So if you don't have to go out for anything, for crying out loud, just stay home, right? I mean, it's working out for me so far. I've mostly just been hanging out in my house. And, you know, keeping busy and stuff. Catch up on some TV shows. Do some workouts. You can get a great workout in. I've been doing five-minute workouts. It's actually... A 10 minute workout program, but I play it back at double speed get a great workout. I highly recommend that you can even do a 30 Minute workout play it back even faster. You can still do it in five minutes get it done real quick Or you could do the full workout I guess because you got to fill the time somehow, right? So maybe just do it the normal speed uh, Anyway, there's plenty of things you could do to stay busy, but for you know Just for everybody's sake just stay home. We're all in this together so, all right, uh, anyway, thanks for stopping by, and I'm glad you joined me to draw a Slimer today. Maybe we'll do another thing tomorrow. Let's see. We'll, we'll see what the future holds for us, right? Thanks for stopping by. Okay, see ya.